Bada bing, bada boom, forget about it. Hello and welcome to the workshop. Thank you for stopping by. We appreciate you very, very much. If you are new to the channel, if this is your first time here or you have not already done so, consider subscribing, especially if you like sneakers because we upload a lot of sneaker videos. It's true, we've been on a mini kind of somewhat of a hiatus buckets. No hiatus. No, you never admit the hiatus. Almost every single day. Almost every single day we upload new videos. So like I said, if you like sneakers, you have come to the right place. You can also find me on Twitter, Instagram, and TikTok at Mr. Palmer Simpson. And if you enjoyed today's video, please hit that thumbs up button. Really does go a long way. Let's us know what kind of content you want to see. Helps the channel continue to grow. All that good stuff. I think we call that a win-win. Last thing I want to mention. Last formality. Uncivilizedstore.com. We're going to put a link in the description of this video. Buckets, who is behind the camera, and myself. We have a clothing brand. That is where we sell it. We got a lot of dope stuff on the website, a lot of dope stuff coming. You can sign up for the email stuff, a lot of cool stuff. So, uncivilizedstore.com, buckets, anything to add, any life advice, a little pep talk for me. You want to hype me up a little bit? No, no, no. Mm -hmm. ah. mm -hmm. ah. Not once. Okay, here we go. Three, two, one, bang, bang. This is the Ama Manir Air Jordan 4. released back in November and retail was 225 bucks. tried to get a pair on the sneakers app. I tried. I tried my hardest, but I was not able to. Shocker. I know I was able to grab this pair from a local resale shop down here in the Tampa area. Kicks are for us. You probably heard us mention them before if you tune in regularly. Appreciate them as always. <laughs> I'm gonna tell you what, right out of the gate, first impression, taking these out of the box. This is my first time seeing the sneaker in hand, by the way. These are incredible. I'm talking phenomenal buckets. Give me an adjective. Wonderful. Wonderful, they are that good. I liked them in pictures, I did, but it's just hard to understand the quality of these until you have them in hand, in my opinion. Now, I really believe this might be the best Jordan sneaker of the year. I'm not trying to overhype them. I really believe that there are a couple other pairs in consideration. I don't know, Buckets, the lost and found Jordan 1. What's another pair that could be in the mix? I mean, that's not in the mix for me, so I don't know. Damn, shots fired. No, I mean, I... I was very open and honest about those when we reviewed them. Okay, all right. So what would be in the mix? I'd have to look at a list. Have to look, you're a list guy. A big time list guy. Big time list guy. I'll tell you what, we gave the Ama Manir 3 sneaker of the year last year, I believe. I think so. So that'd be crazy. Back to back, you do a three, and you know, this is not an unpopular or uncommon opinion. I'm not going against the grain here when I say that the Ama Manir Air Jordan 3 was absolutely immaculate. And following up with these, I think they're right on par, man. I really do. I think they are on that level. There's just such a premium vibe to them. The message behind the sneaker is really dope as well. Reading off the Ama Manir website, it said, this moment is inspired by the black and brown leaders changing the world from the heart of their community with purpose, passion, and vision. You know, it's about the direction that things are moving. It's about where you're going. It's about that shooting for buckets. What is it? The stars, your dreams, running it down, tackling it, boom. Putting that shoulder on them. Putting that, you, you gotta do it. You gotta put that shoulder on them sometimes. Yeah, it's aspirational. Exactly, so dope sneaker, dope colorway, dope message. I think we call that the trifecta. 
We do. We do. You've got this super premium leather on most of the upper. Technically, they are calling this color violet or it's a very super nuanced shade of purple. Basically, well, number one, it's very, very nice, but it's kind of hard to explain these types of shades when they're so subtle like this, but it does have a very royal vibe to it and it is buttery soft. <laughs> And you've got all the standard Jordan 4 features, the netting on the sides, on the bottom of the tongue, the wings on the side of the sneaker, heel tab with the Nike Air on the back. As you can see, you've got the Ama Manir logo on the tongue with that flight written in white beneath it. Burgundy hang tag, burgundy boys, gang, 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 sorry, I had to do it. With more Amma Manier branding, along with the Jumpman logo, another cool touch is the message on the underside or the backside of the heel tab here. It's not about the shoes, it's about where you're going. Really dig that. Again, goes back into the whole message, the whole inspiration behind the sneaker. And probably my favorite aspect of the sneaker, just aesthetically speaking, is the quilted interior. Absolutely marvelous. I don't know what a king's throne feels like, full disclosure, I don't. But in my mind, I imagine it would feel something like this. It is that luxurious. Same thing on the insole, by the way, that whole quilted treatment, it is just Mutabella. The midsole is black, cream, and a little bit of that darker burgundy peeking through, as you can see. Same colors on the outsole. The majority of it is cream, couple burgundy hits, and you've got that Nike branding in black right in the middle. This sneaker is perfection. I mean, yes, maybe I am a little biased. It's true because I do love the Jordan 4. I do love burgundy. Burgundy boys, gang, gang, gang. You know, buckets, when uh, pictures of these first released. I had people tagging me on Instagram. Burgundy boys, gang, gang, burgundy boys, gang, gang, burgundy boys, gang, gang. And I know I it, it warmed it warmed me heart because I knew that I have delivered the message to the people. Anytime there's a burgundy sneaker, the tags, the foamy tags, they start raining in, they start pouring. Yeah, so I don't really think this is burgundy. No, but with the little peek through on the bottom, the hang tag. I, I can't claim it for Burgundy Boys. I mean, I guess you can. We've claimed much further away colors. Anything basically from red to purple. I just, I put the shoulder. Yeah. Put the shoulder on this side, put the shoulder on this side, and I just I just bear hug it. Okay. I bear hug it. Anyway, thanks to everyone who tagged me. Instagram, at Mr. Cormac Simpson. I'll let you boy. Uh, in closing, buckets, we're going to do a top 10 sneakers of the year list like we always do spoiler alert these are going to be on the list yeah these are definitely going to be on the list uh i'll even go so far as to say i can't see these outside of the top five and that's for all brands maybe number one you have to tune in to find out we'll see maybe i've already said too much I, i've i've uh divulged you've showed your hand i've showed my hand the opposite of what you do scale of one to ten ten out of ten perfect sneaker uh no complaints at all what are you going to do? Hey, what are you going to do? So I says to the guy, bucket, scale of one to 10. Don't let me down on these. You let me down almost every day. That's your thing. Almost every day, you let me down. Okay. Please don't do it on these. Well, I might, but it's a nine and a half. Nine and a half. Yeah. Beautiful. The Jordan 4 is your favorite Jordan sneaker of all time as far as Jordan retros go. Yep. The best. I love Jordan 4s. The cream of the crop. The very best. You got a burgundy colorway ish ish you got a violet or yeah and you're into them i really like them the the, the print i'm telling you it's that quilted interior you put your foot in that and it's just like i don't know are you part of the royal family possibly no but maybe it feels that way okay there we go leave a comment below let us know how do you feel about this sneaker this colorway the collaboration i'm on near where do these rank for you as far as top 10 list? Come on, these gotta be on your top 10. They gotta be. Buckets, even if they're 10, they gotta be in that list. But well, I'm not gonna tell anyone to put anything in any list. I guess that's true. Let us know, where do these rank amongst all the other Jordan sneakers that released this year? Always love to hear from you, so leave a comment below. Uh, thank you for watching. Uh, Buckets, we will be back tomorrow. tomorrow.
For sure. Always. Yes. Same time, same place, right here at the workshop. The new workshop, by the way. Studio workshop tour coming very soon. By very soon, I mean a few weeks. And I do actually mean tomorrow. There's a video. I know I say almost every single day. But we are coming back tomorrow. Yeah. We'll be here. Same time, same place. Adios. Thank you.